my friend, Mr. Bobby Green, has something to say to you on this rarely discussed subject. Howdy, folks. My name is Bob B. Green, and I work for the Society for the Prevention of Cruelty to Plants and Malls across America. You know, the SPCPIMAA, the shopping mall's my beat. Hooey, I tell you. Some of the things I've seen in this place would make your ferns shudder and your vines crawl, I'm telling you. Now, just because the music at the mall is fake doesn't mean the plants are, too. No, sir. Plants are living beings, just like wolverines or wombats. Only plants can clean and refresh that trapped air that's, that's polluted inside here. Wolverines and wombats can't do that. Now then, the job of a hard-working shopping mall plant isn't made any easier by shoppers who abuse them. Now, come on, let me show you. How would you like to be on the receiving end of one of these several times a day? Ladies and gentlemen, plants are not ashtrays. Plants are natural air fresheners. Now, without any complaint or pay, they work overtime sucking up all them nasty compounds and turning them into fresh air. And what about them junior plant abusers? You know, the future leaders of America? Why, their diet consists of nothing but gooey candy, greasy fries, sticky sodas, and wads and wads of weirdly flavored bubble gum. Yeah, watermelon flavored and strawberry flavored and grape flavored and so on and so forth. Now, all these flavors are named, of course, after cousins of our friend here, Mr. Plant. But do you think they show Mr. Plant any respect? No, sir. Now, this stuff is not fertilizer, folks. It's like nuclear waste or uh, styrofoam cups or taxes. You just can't get rid of this stuff. Just like those people that don't believe the plants are real live breathing beings. You know the type. The ones that just can't resist walking by a bunch of plants and plucking their leaves so they can't breathe. You pluck the leaf off a wombat, you'll be missing your leaves, I'll tell you what. Let's see, where's that rest of that stuff? Them darn junior abusers. Well, I guess what I'm trying to say is, we at the SPCPIMAA would just like you to be a little more considerate about the needs and rights of our green neighbors. Just remember, what we're breathing out, they're breathing in. And without them, heck, we wouldn't be breathing at all. I mean, we are in this all together, right? Humans, plants, wolverines, and wombats. Hey, uh, what the heck is a wombat anyway? It's an animal, right? <laughs>